What we do here is go back, 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 back. back. I really want to put my logo on that one. Uh -huh. You ain't funny. That's not true. Maybe you're just boring as fuck and lame as hell. Anyways, I'll be taking down some of your videos. But yeah, I just hope you stop. She mastered the opposite of titty streaming by pretending to not show her butt every time. Dude! And I'm gonna be honest, I think the only way people like this stop is if people like me and my community give them feedback that this is not an okay thing to do. Not attack them. Wow, Ethan, great moves. Keep it up. Proud of you. Keith, shut the fuck up. Will you leave Pokemon alone? It's my fucking queen and I will fucking end you. Keith, shut the fuck up. Will you leave Pokemon? But I had a little dislike and I say, this not cool. That's how YouTubers work. If they're not going to work off of morals, they're going to work off of dislikes and comments and whatever. No, I really don't give a shit. If you're a big fan of her, please come at me. Come at me, seriously. Dislike the video and leave a mean comment. It doesn't even do anything, dude. Even if Pokimane wants to remove the video, it doesn't change the fact that you're a fucking loser. Pokimane is one of the biggest streamers on Twitch. She plays video games on stream, tries very hard to be funny, reacts to videos, and a lot of people respect her because, in their words, you know, she doesn't really show tits or... She's charming and interesting to watch in front of a camera. She's attractive, and to my knowledge, she's pretty good at the game she plays. Let's just get into it. 80% of Pokimane streams is just her watching videos, adding actually nothing to what she's watching whatsoever. There's times where she's just straight up eating while watching YouTube while people donate to her, which, if people want to be that sad, fair enough. But it's a little bit funny when you take into account that even though she does this shit all day, at the same time, behind the scenes, she actively tries to censor the internet. And by the internet, I mean anything negative about her. People have made videos about her, and she's copyright strike them, the list goes on and on. If you make a video that is negative about her, she's gonna try to gun you. And I'm not the one saying that. That's her. And I had spoken to my MCN, and I was like, is this something that I can take down? Because, like, I was getting, a, like, a lot of annoying, uh shit from it at the time mm -hmm. and i mean understandably so it was something that we put out on the internet so i get that mm. but i was like maybe if we like kill this whole Let's drama to be up. over yeah. yeah yeah here's a sick clip of her taking down someone's video live while also fucking with them at the same time and then clips and then like edit it and like uh give credits to the, the other youtubers and streamers wow i'm so sorry that it takes you a lot of time to steal other people's content i'm so sorry oh my god no and put it together i'm <laughs> so sorry that it takes you so much time to go to the top clips on fortnite and then just right click and save all of them as and then just like put them all into premiere and then just like export it i'm so sorry <sighs> I'm so sorry. Am I mean not? I mean, am I... I don't even know what to say, bro. Anyways, I'll be taking down some of your videos, but... <gasps> yeah, I just hope you stop doing this. If you edit videos and actually put mm -hmm. effort into it and make it more entertaining for the viewer, like if you do a... Oh, a bunch of Fortnite streamers you react mean, to something me, and you time, like, to find put the it together. Clips and then clips and then, like, edit it and, like, uh, give credits to the... Yeah, the dude that's working out of a sweatshop in some random third world country that's going to Twitch, sorting by the most popular clips, and then just taking them all and putting them into a video is doing more editing than Pokemon. <laughs> You know, it's just extra sick when most of her content is shit like this. I have some pretty good competition. I'm not talking about him, okay? I'm talking about him. I don't know why, but I have to say it, bro. He's looking really cute in this picture. No homo, obviously. Given that I've hit a million subs, by the way, there's actually... I'm sorry, but I think I'm being very legitimate by not encouraging your kind of behavior. Because imagine all content creators just ran around picking on and attacking other people's fans. Like, I understand that we can put up with a lot of shit, but most people don't know how to deal with that kind of thing. Cool irony. She talks about the viewers and her concern for them, aka you right there. Hello. She talks about how you guys can't take a joke, but her and Keemstar, they can. Even though she was going to her legal team trying to see if she could remove videos. That's pretty funny, dude. Again, Keem, do better. 
Have a good day. The word hypocrite is definitely not good enough. Whatever the word is that makes her get canceled, that's the one I want to go with. What is that word? Hmm. That's a good question. I'm just going to go with fucking idiot. To be fair, I actually can't believe anyone would sponsor these shenanigans. Like, what? And I will say, for this company to sponsor a video that's literally 20 minutes of talking shit about me? Bro, she's straight up trying to carry in anyone that doesn't make a video supporting her. Really want to put my logo on that one! Do better. So after she ended up getting some shit, she ended up apologizing. I can admit I made a mistake. I just wish, like, the process of making a mistake, having people tell you, realizing it, and then... Um, it, owning up to it and doing better was a little bit easier on the I mean, internet, yeah. People which might be a lot to ask, but it's like, mm. I literally, I kill this. Whatever, man. Moving on. <laughs> Pokemon has no redeeming qualities and is not funny at all. I'm so quirky, guys. I have a tampon in my mouth. Haha, <laughs> random. I also have meme music going on. Hee <laughs> hee. Announcement to make? Oh my god, did you hear that? That is like the best- that, that's one of the best burps I've ever done. Did you hear it? I would rather donate $5,000 to Alinity than 50 bucks to Pokemon. I'd watch Jake Paul vlogs before Pokemon. I'd watch gay porn before Pokemon. I think I'd watch anything on YouTube before Pokemon. Her stream is shit. I'd rather watch Alinity kill cats on stream, and I'm not talking about vodka or anything like that. I'm talking about like with a fucking knife, then watch Pokemon stream, and I'm not joking about that whatsoever. People keep having this idea that I'm being sarcastic all the time when I'm being dead serious. If you're Alinity's number one fan, I have more respect for you as a human being than if you're a fan of Pokemon. There's nothing else more to add. Oh my god. I remember when I first started playing Sage. I need to do some sort of a reenactment. Hold on. So this is my dead teammate. And I'm like out of range here. And then here, I can start doing this shit. You know when you want to do her ultimate? You start doing this shit. So I'm like, oh wait, I'm okay. I pressed the ultimate. Can you revive yet? Can you revive? Hello? Can you revive? Can you revive? And me. Hold up. Into PC games when I was like 13, yikes. I should not have known what that meant at 13. I cannot believe the amount of people- Nearly every single titty streamer on Twitch is more funny than Pokemon. Even the ones that are speaking fucking Russian and shit. <laughs> Copyright claims exist all over YouTube, but most of the time they just claim the video, so the video stays up and they take the money. So why would Pokemon actually take down videos? Well, if there's one thing that I've learned while watching her streams and watching how she reacts to criticism and whatnot, it's that Pokemon has this image that she's trying to maintain. And she's really trying to maintain that image. And the image is that she is not a titty streamer. I took down a guy's video and because of that, I'm like a Twitch thought. And just to call me a thought, was it worth it? And then 17,000 people thought that that was a cool thing to do. Nice! Oh, uh, is this a video where some random dude behind a VR machine calls a girl a thought for 20 minutes? Dude, that isn't her. Of course not. No matter what, they can't see her as a titty streamer because her entire, like, image is built on this idea of respect. And she is not that person that if you donate $30 to her, she's gonna run around and bend over on stream. She's actually much worse. There's no fucking comparison at all. This is the part where I try to win a little bit of her fan base over to establish some crossover. Just kidding. If you're a Pokemon fan, I have no respect for you as a human being. Hi, hi. Oh. This person quickly pulled out their phone and captured this boulder tumbling down a mountain. If you the boulder didn't edit hit anyone, videos and, was hurt. and actually put yeah. effort into it what? and make it more entertaining for the viewer. Very close. <laughs>
Pokimane isn't even attractive. There's really no other way of saying it, she's just not hot, dude. I'm not saying that to fuck with her, I'm not even saying it to fuck with you guys. She's just really not hot. The average person on Twitch is more attractive than Pokimane. At least with the titty streamers, a lot of them are hot. Pokimane really doesn't have that going for her so much. I'm thinking 3 out of 10. Uh, if not, you know, actually Keemstar probably had it right. Again, Kim, do better. This part is just for you guys, you tier 3 subs. She has a boyfriend. Let me say that one more time. Dude, she has a boyfriend and you're fucking pathetic. <laughs> I feel like touching on another point really quick, which is, um, after you guys get done donating to her, she goes and fucks someone else. Nice! <laughs> Yeah, the caption already sums it up, but I just want to throw a little bit more salt in your face if you're actually a tier 3 sub. A fucking lol. Except it's really not. Pokemon isn't hot. She censors the internet because she has to maintain an image that she's this respectable streamer, when in reality she's just as bad as any other titty streamer. Her fans are worse than furries that have sex with each other in furry costumes. And if you ever happen to come across one of her big time fans, you know, one of those tier 3 subs, just on your way to the grocery store or whatnot, be sure to remind them that she has a boyfriend. Because I think that they would really love to hear that little piece of information, and I bet she would too. And you know, a lot of the time she's just reacting to videos, so, you know, I think she could go for some discussion. She wouldn't mind that. I mean, I just think it would be a really interesting topic, and it totally wouldn't completely demolish her entire image in front of her fucking loser fan base. <laughs> Do better. Have a good day. You are a vile slime of a human that will nobody will ever want you because you're so pathetic. Maybe you should calm down. No, I'm serious. <laughs> I'm not calming down. It's the saddest shit I have ever fucking heard.